Hello and welcome to 5-Minute Math. Today we are looking at the 5th grade concept of identifying prime and composite numbers. This is standard 5.4a in the great state of Texas and we are using item number 13 off the 2017 released star test. If you have not done so already, please go ahead and take a moment to pause the video, work this problem out on your own, unpause it, and then we will look at our answers together. So, Brenda says that the number 2 is prime because it only has two factors. Carla said that the number 2 is composite because it is even and all even numbers are composite. Mm -hmm. Who is correct? Well, let's see. What is prime and composite? That's going to be our first question. So, prime numbers are numbers that have only two factors. And those two factors are 1 and itself. So let's get an example. Let's say 5. The only way that you can multiply any two numbers to get to 5, 5 times 1. It's the only way to do it. So composite Those numbers have three or more factors. So let's look at a few examples. So let's look at 9. So 9, you can do always 9 times 1. You can also do 3 times 3. So this one has three factors, 1, 3, and 9. You only list that 3 one time. Those are the three factors of 9. But then you've got bigger numbers, right? You've got like 50. And you can multiply 50 times 1, always. You could do 25 times 2. You could do 10 times 5. Right? There's six different ways, six different factors that you can get up to 50. So these are composite and these are prime. Now here's my question. What about the number 2? Well... How do we get the number 2? The number 2 is 2 times 1. Hmm. Well, that's the only way I can get 2. If that's the case, it looks like I am making my answer of prime, saying that Brenda is correct. She said it's prime. Let's write these right here, because that's kind of a confusing way to get the answers. Carla said it's composite but 2 is even. And all even numbers are composite. Well, are all even numbers composite? Well, let's see. I've got 4, 6, 8, well, let's just do 10, and let's just do 12. Let's see what we can do for these. Well, 4, I can do 1 times 4, and yep, I can do 2 times 2. 6, I can do 1 times 6. I can do, yep, 2 times 3. Notice how 2 keeps showing up in my even numbers. 1 times 8 gets me 8. 2 times 4. So there's my 2 again. I can do 1 times 10. And I can do 2 times 5. So you notice our pattern here. I've got 2 times 2, 2 times 3, 2 times 4, 2 times 5. This one's going to be slightly different because I can do a 2 times 6. But 12 also I can do with 3 times 4. So that's got 6 factors. So all even numbers are composite because they have 2 except, uh, that's, put that in capitals there, except the very first even number, 2. Because look, 2 only has two factors, 1 and 2. So 2, that's prime. We'll whisper that. We don't want it to feel like it's like it's not like all the other even numbers out there. But 2 is different. 2 is prime. So can't be D. Neither of them is correct. Kind of hard to make both of them correct. C Carla is almost correct. But the correct answer is A, Brenda. 2 is prime.